Well, I guess we're in the wrong one here. I don't see the the book anywhere. Unless it's in this room here that I skipped over, it looks like. Nope, this isn't the right one. And I am completely out of uh, healing potions. And out of health, too. <laughs> I'm gonna go back to town real quick. Get some potions before I die. Hello. A uh, little tip when you uh, are buying potions, if you want to fill up all the slots in your belt, you just hold shift and right click. I can remember which zone the temple is in for that quest. It could be in the next area. I'm not sure. Those temples along the causeway leading right here. This is the causeway, I believe. I might be down in one of these temples. skull piles down here, huh? Looks like they've been doing some human sacrifice or something. Or eating people, possibly. Never can count out cannibalism. Of course we are in a reliquary. There's that not thinking again. This <laughs> this entire building's just a tomb. It's where they put dead people. It's locked.
It's green! I think I probably could have completed this set by now. That's something I used to do um, on the Battle.net servers when I played multiplayer. I would create uh, mule characters, they called them, which basically was just a storage character where you would um, you know, collect items and I would collect set items. Oh goodness. Ooh. Yeah, I think I'm gonna skip that. What's well, off to the side here? Nope, no temples over here. Or ruins. Yeah, I don't like this terraced area, these uh, terraces here, because the AI doesn't handle the pathfinding too well. Alright, we've gotten the message to kill the High Council, so we must be getting close to the Travancle, or however you pronounce it, Travancle? No clue. I'm going to go ahead and take out these um, water monsters if this guy will pop up. Just a little bit shy. Just a little bit shy. There we go. A good strategy is uh, to pull back because as a group, they're really strong, so you want to, you know, draw them away one by one and pick them off that way. And also, it seems like, if you're playing a Necromancer, it seems like your summons have a really tough time killing those water creatures for some reason. They can't reach them, I guess, because they're out in the water. So you might want to take those out yourself. Well, it doesn't seem like they want to come out here and play. Maybe they are keen to my strategy. Maybe I should just let my summons go at it and see how they do. I'm not really placing a lot of confidence in them, but maybe they can handle it just fine. Seem to be doing pretty well so far. And there's the flail. Oh yeah, they did just fine. Very nice. Oh yeah, I've got a skill point here I need to assign. I'm going to go ahead and put that into Bone Spirit. And that's the next skill I'm going to max out. Okay. The next step is to imbue the flail with all these parts here, body parts. So I want to do that. And you have to smash this compelling orb. <laughs> Looks like there's still a council member still alive. No? We completed that one. I can't. 
Okay, I guess before you smash the orb, you have to talk to Deckard. So let's go back and do that. Masterfully done, hero. You have crafted Kaleem's will. Employ it to destroy the compelling orb and open the way to Mephisto. May the true light guide your way. Ridding Kurast of the Council of Zakarum was essential. Still, there is more you must do. The compelling orb, too, must be destroyed. Diablo and Bale must be close to finding their brother Mephisto by now. You've no time to waste. Impossible. There we go. Now all that's left to do is find Mephisto and kill him. Hopefully it's just as easily done as said. Got to be careful down here. Um, those meteors they're casting do a lot of fire damage. So you don't want one landing on your head. And I'm going to take it pretty slow in this area because things can get pretty hairy down here. You don't want to get uh, ganged up on. There's another low-level set item. Let's see what this is. Just out of curiosity. Hmm. Just trying to see if I could remember. Take a guess at what it was, but I don't really remember. Yep, Eisenhart's. Level 8 set item. Level two. And, uh, you just saw an example of things getting hairy right there. You had these big guys and these casters, and there were little pygmy skeletons as well. time getting to those guys. There we go. 